Hey guys, how's it going? I uh, just got home from a nice walk around Portsmouth and I saw that the mailman had been to my door and brought a package. It's from cell 411, get cell411.com and I have a feeling I know what it is so I'm excited. Uh, one of the, or the creator, Virgil Vaduva, um, posted that at the website, there would be Bluetooth enabled buttons that can operate the app Cell 411. So, pretty cool. Looks like uh, there's two of them in here and a, a message of some kind, maybe some instructions. Cool. So I'm just going to read it. Um, this is what's inside. Dear friends, for almost one year, Cell 411 has been consistently delivering a... Let me put this up. <laughs> Dear friends, for almost one year, Cell 411 has been consistently delivering a mobile app and an emergency response platform that aims at replacing violent government services with a voluntary system based on nonviolence and peaceful human interaction. So far, we have successfully added 60,000 users to our platform and continue to add more every day. Wow. By the time you receive this letter, Version 4 of Cell 411 should be available for general download in the Apple and Google App Stores. And with this version, we have introduced support for our new Bluetooth personal panic button. Because you have such a big supporter, you've been such a big supporter of our project, we've included a free panic button for you to use with Cell 411. Oh, thanks. This device can be paired with Cell 411 and be used in an emergency situation to alert your friends or any private or public cell if and when you need help. For instructions on how to do so, go to getcell411.com slash button. You can also simply tap the panic button menu option in Cell 411 and follow the instruction on the screen to pair and use the button with your smartphone. All we are asking in return is that you help us promote Cell 411 and the new panic button to your friends and family and perhaps post about it on social media outlets like Facebook and Twitter. I will certainly do that. Thank you for supporting Cell 411 and for being a part of our efforts to make the world a better place. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me. Sincerely, Virgil Vaduva. Thanks, Virgil. This is so cool. Okay, so I have one of these boxes. Um, you saw, I just opened it up, I haven't seen this before, and I'm very excited! Almost dropped my keys. I saw this, um, article recently that was in, I think the Telegraph or some British rag, where a British woman was so offended and upset she had found a Reddit post where it was everyday carry, and uh, she saw that Americans usually carry knives in their pockets, like, and guns, oh my god, uh, they defend themselves, yeah, so... Okay. Ooh, and there's a sticker falling out. Cool. Cool for a, a laptop or guitar case or anything you wear. Okay, what do we have? Some kind of jelly ring thing. Inside we have a, a watch band looking thing that holds Looks like it holds something. Oh, maybe it holds this. This must be it. Okay. Take it out of the box. And it's kind of like sticky taped onto there so that it doesn't fall out. And held in very securely. But here it is. This is, uh, this looks like this is it. Just this one little button. Let me get this other stuff out of the way. I'm pushing it. It's a button. It's nice and it has a good press to it. 
It's very distinct. I couldn't accidentally press it. But it's it's not something that you have to push too hard that it wouldn't register. It's a good good button. It's got a little nice feel, maybe kind of like a micro grooved texture on there. You can kind of see like a small vinyl record. And um but it's plastic, weighs like uh I guess less than an ounce. And it looks like you put it in this kind of ring and then or maybe put it in here. I don't really know. <clears throat> oh, this this is interesting. So there's a little in this bag. Looks like this will hold it also. So it's like a money clip sort of thing, or maybe it clips onto your clothes so you can push the button there. And then it looks like there's even another sticker. Does this map? Oh, wow. That's that's cute. That's cute. So it's got its uh, cell 411 button. Here, let me put it together. See if this will snap in. So there it is. Bam, it's, it's on. Clip it onto my shirt. I'm not usually good <laughs> facing backwards into the camera. Okay. Well, dang, this is tight. I'll just keep trying with it. Have to shorten this video. There. Okay. All right. So, and that's good. And so you know it's tight and it's held securely. Um, it sits right here. I can push it easily if I got an emergency and it's not going to get accidentally hit if it's up here or wherever you want to put it. A little clip like this could go anywhere on your, your back pocket or anything. And then here's one It looks like um, that's a watch even. So Oh, and then it looks like to eject, there's a little button here and let's see, it pops, pops right out. And then we've got a little watch band here. I'm going to try popping that in. Cool, okay. And this is a, you know, multi-size. Looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different holes uh, that you can use to secure this watch wristband. And let's see, I'm on numbers six and five and six fits my wrist secure i don't wear a watch so it wouldn't be a problem for me to have add an extra thing to my wrist in fact i would find this to be a lot more useful than a watch because i already use a, a cell phone so this is the cell 411 personal panic button and you can get your own at getcell411.com. Virgil, thank you so much. You are making the world a better place, you and everyone who helps use Cell411. If you're not familiar with the app already, I'm assuming that you already do watching this video, which I shouldn't assume. So uh, Cell411 is an app for responding to emergencies um, among networks, and it's peer-to-peer. -peer. So if I download it on my phone, uh, it's free in the Google app, the Google store and um, Apple store. And I get connected with other people, other cells in my area. Uh, if I have an emergency, I just tap on the home screen there where I am and then choose a button to say what the emergency is. And that alert goes out to everyone like in the 50 mile radius and then everyone who you've listed on your um you know, on your like friends list, your cells, and there are public cells and private cells. So it's, it's amazing. And what it really does, the bottom line is it could replace police. It could replace police. You don't need police in your area <clears throat> to protect you. If you have friends and neighbors and communities that already have networks and technology to support each other. 
in the event of these emergencies that do a better job than the police and for less money, for, for basically free. So, you know, we can protect ourselves, we can uh, protect our communities, ourselves. Uh, this is how we do it. We build networks with each other. Um, voluntary interaction, technology, you know, developing cool products like, oh, I have an emergency, bam, I can push this button and have my friends appear knowing that I was maybe pulled over or um, maybe, I, you know, it, it could be whatever the situation is, I bet you can pre-program this thing to say like what kind of uh, interaction you, you might expect to have. Cops are at my door or whatever. So I see the, a lot of use in these things. I would want to keep maybe one in my car at all times, like on my visor. Um, I could even clip this thing to my hat, you know, if I'm out cop blocking, you know, I can tap it if um, someone's being arrested and, and go live stream. You know, I, I might even be able to trigger a live stream. That, that would be pretty cool. Um, so I'm going to go check out the latest version. I haven't even downloaded it yet. Let's go see what it is. Um, and thanks so much. Keep the world peaceful, guys.